We're going to start by, uh, we're going to be putting the stuffing in the oven. We're not going to actually stuff the bird like we may have mentioned, or uh, we're going to do it on the side because it's a much easier way of preparing stuffing on the side, okay? We're going to put this in a parchment paper, so I may as well do that now. And the idea of the parchment paper is so that, one, it'll steam in its natural own flavors. Um, two, we can put it in the oven and basically forget about it, and that's what easy cooking is all about. Okay? So I got a fair bit here. You might want to do this in two batches. I'm just going to do three quarters of it right now. You'll notice I have a bowl of water in front of me. But now, I'm going to want to moisten the bread and form it on the parchment paper. And the best way is with moist, damp hands. The reason is, it won't stick for you, okay? It's pretty clean to do it this way as well. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to shape it in the parchment paper so that it will sit nice and snug and tight inside both layers. So that's the reason why you mold it first, okay? Now, very easily, you fold the top, fold the other top, the other side, and tuck in the base, okay? We're not, <laughs> we're not doing anything too uh, difficult here at all. Same thing goes. So lift it up gently and tuck it in. It's not airtight, but it's the next best thing. And you know what? It's very, very easy. We are going to wrap the sides of the foil, kind of like wrapping a Christmas gift, I guess. I don't usually do it all that often, so. I'm gonna fold over the remainder of the foil. It may seem like a bit of an excessive amount of foil, but there's a reason for it. I am actually gonna wrap this twice in aluminum foil. And that way I can put it in the oven for as long as it needs and not have to worry about it. Parchment paper is an incredible invention. The food's gonna steam inside. It's gonna take probably a good 45 minutes to be thoroughly hot, and then it's ready for